Body Blender here for Horror Tree with my Horror Tree weekly wrap up. And today I'm going to be talking about some of the amazing submission calls that are up on the Horror Tree website. So let's get into it. All right, the first one is Bridget's Gate Press Dangerous Waters Deadly Women of the Sea Anthology. These guys are after mermaids, selkies, sirens, and spirits. Think scary, think deadly, think dangerous. They want these women lethal guys, so go nuts with this theme. They're after stories that include the ocean or the sea, but they will also consider stories that involve rivers. They're looking for stories, poems, and drabbles. The stories, the word count for the stories is 500 to 3,500 words, poetry up to 350 words, and drabbles have to be exactly 100 words. Subs open on the 1st of June, close on the 30th of June, and the stories are 0 0.08 cents a word. Poems, $50 a poem, and drabbles, $50 a drabble. Plus, you get a copy of the ebook and a paperback copy of the anthology. Number two is Allegory by Annual Magazine, Volume 42. The theme here is speculative fiction, primarily horror, science fiction and fantasy they're looking for good solid fiction with this call guys so they will consider other genres provided the work is quirky so the word count there's really no minimum or maximum length um but they have said that any flash fiction of less than 100 words or any stories of less than 500 words as well as stories that are over 5,000 words are a hard sell Subs open on the 1st of May, close on the 30th of June, and the flat rate payment here is $15 per story. Next up is The Last Girls Club magazine, quarterly feminist horror magazine. They are looking for stories for their fall issue. Now this theme is um, a really special one. It is the gay 90s. So they want you to think of growing up or coming out in not so friendly not so gay friendly towns so think homophobic rants on the streets by protesters think of hidden clubs and hangouts in seedy alleys being raided by skinheads and police like just think of homophobic country towns small towns beach towns wherever you may have lived and grown up and come out you might have been closeted you might have been converted you might have been cast out if you lived it, you know exactly what they are referring to, and that is what they are after. Um, this theme is dedicated to the editor's friend who lived it, so this is a really special issue. And the editor wants it to memorialise the ones that fought to make things better and to celebrate the ones who survived and their continued existence. So this is a really important call, really important theme, and a really special one. So. Best of luck with this one, guys. Um, they're looking for flash fiction, fiction and poetry. The word count for flash is a thousand words or less. Fiction, two and a half thousand words or less. And poetry is 200 words or less. Subs open on the 1st of July, close on the 1st of August. Short stories, they pay 0.01 cent per word, $25 max. Poems, $10 and flash fiction, $10. And last, certainly not least, is Alien Dimensions issue number 23. These guys want space, they want aliens, they want alien worlds. They want this to be set in the future, a hundred years or more. They want it fast paced and they want it preferably written in the third person. If you are going to include aliens in your stories, guys, they want them to be friendly. Um, they're looking for 5,000 to 7,000 words. Subs open on the 1st of June and close on the 31st of July and payment is $20 per story. Now, I strongly recommend you check out their website because they have more details on what they're looking for in the submission call and they've put up some awesome examples for you guys to draw inspiration from. So definitely get on there and check it out. So all these calls are absolutely fantastic and they're great opportunities. The themes are great but they're also unusual and they're inviting the writer to go beyond what they'd normally write and challenge themselves there's even a few there that i'm considering submitting to so if you are considering submitting to any of these good luck if any of them grab you please get on the horror tree website check out the submission calls and for those who have stuck with me for this long thank you and until next time stay cool stay safe stay spooky see ya Thank you.